hello guys welcome back to my channel in this tutorial i will teach you how to create a professional healthcare assistant or certified nursing assistant cv okay with or without experience if you have experience or you don't have experience please stick around from start to finish of this video because i will show you how you can create the professional healthcare assistant cv or certified nursing assistant cv without any experience okay without further much ado let's get into this video please guys try and watch this video from start to finish because all the steps are so important this video is not sponsored so i don't want you to start wasting money to download the temp the cv after you create it online stick around from start to finish i will show you at the, at the end of this video how you can get the cv for free of charge without paying anything okay first of all you come over to create your cv the name of this web website is lifecarrier.com okay how to create a job on this cv choose your professionally designed template Add priority examples to each session. Download and start applying. Let's go. You know, getting a job now is very, very difficult. So you have to create a very professional CV. Have you ever written a CV before? Let's say no. So that we can be able to get everything are you a student let's say no okay you see this is the best thing about this website they show you templates of each country you don't need to start saying ah i want to apply for a job in uk i want to apply for a job in dubai i want to apply for a job in singapore I want to apply for a job in this, 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 that, and I don't know the CV they are using. Guys, this website will give you everything that you want, okay? Let's say I want to apply for a job in here. I'm in Dubai, United Arab Emirates. You click, see templates. These are the type of CV that they are using here in Dubai okay if you're in dubai this is the step of cv that they are using here you don't need to start saying ah i'm not doing the right thing dubai has two cv number one if you like you upload your picture if you don't like you don't upload okay but the, for the sake of this video we will be uploading our picture guys as you are here you you choose which of the templates that you want the best design that you like just click on them okay you click on the template that you want to use let's say see all templates see all just choose any of the templates that you know you like very well and then use it to create your cv Okay, let's take for instance, I like this one. Sorry, sorry. Let's take for instance, I like this, this uh, template. Then I press click. You can also change the color if you want, okay? Let's click. Choose this template. How do you want to build your CV? Create a new CV. We go through each session together. I already have your CV. We transfer everything to your new template. That is, if you have a CV before and you just want to add a template to it, you, you click this one. But if you want to create a new CV, you click create a new CV. I'm creating a new CV, okay? Then right here, 
What do you do? First name. Let's say your first name is. Let me see. Eric. And your surname is. Right. Then your country. I mean Dubai. UAE. Then postal code. The back postal code is zero 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 zero. Okay. Then your phone number. Zero five four two two three two seven eight one. Okay. Guys, if you know you are applying in Dubai, you can start with zero five. But if you know you are you are applying in other country. That is, you are in Dubai, you want to apply for a job in another country. You remove this zero plus. Let's just do it once and for all. Plus 971. Okay, this is it, guys. Then your email. If you know you don't have a professional email, try and create a professional email, okay? jimmy.com what next you click continue okay guys i want to add a photo to this okay let's add a photo Create a you have you need to have a professional photo, okay? This is it guys. Set that is it. Try and have a professional photo. Oh I'm using a lady photo. Let me hear you said uh, any name. Okay, let me see bro. Then just forget about the name. Just focus on what you are doing. Then next, skip for now. I don't. Skip for now. Okay. What next? The next one is experience. Now fill in your experience session. You click. Add your experience, your job title. That is your previous job title. Let's say, for instance, you don't have any experience as a healthcare, as you don't have any healthcare background. Okay, let's say, for instance, you don't have any healthcare background. I will advise you your school caregiver. Okay, caregiver, if they ask you any question, caregiver is very simple. You can just use your experience uh, in practical to do it let's say job title we write caregiver you can see caregiver you can see everything is here caregiver elderly caregiver private caregiver child caregiver personal caregiver living caregiver senior caregiver certified caregiver live in caregiver what are you going to choose you choose anyone that you know you can be able to answer the questions in case if you come during your interview sometimes they will not ask you any question about it but i believe sometimes they will ask you what do you know about this caregiver stuff just go online and check for interview, uh, interview questions for this caregiver you'll be able to answer it even if you don't even go online caregiver is just about caring for people it might be elderly people, uh, shared, uh, children, and all of that. Okay, let us see. Um, let's see, care option. Let's just use normal. Let's say elderly caregiver. Then your employer. You know you don't have experience. You don't. You don't have not worked as a caregiver before, but you just want to put it there. So that there should be a head background 
in your CV. Just choose any hospital. Let's take for instance um Abdul Abdullah Abdullah Clinic Well Abdullah Honke more better Okay the country any country that you know you did you, you put the country that you are from okay that's the best way to win the saving you put your country okay put the country that you are from that's the best way let's say i'm from canada or i'm from any let's say i'm from okay let's take for instance you are from here let me just put um, from Ghana for instance the date I will advise you guys try and put like three three years of experience okay that's the best way try and put three years of experience okay come over to this side you say you started in uh, 2018, which month? You can put March 2018. The day you ended it, um, you can say Let's change this one to 2017, 2017, 2018, 1893. Okay, let's put 2017. Okay, So you ended it on uh, 2018, 2019. Let me put 2017 here so that in case 2017, then you ended it in what year? Um, let's say you ended it in 2020. So then you can say February. And there is it guys, you click, they will recommend for you, you don't need to start thinking of what to add, just click, you read through, you click, you can see guys, you click, you click, add as many as you wish, you click. If you know you want to also edit this you can also add if you want to add anything to all this you can also add add anything you want to add okay but i'm not adding anything okay what next you click continue guys if you know you have not subscribed to this channel please do it to do so because that motivates me to do more video like this okay Try and subscribe to this channel, turn on the notification bell so that anytime we upload another good video like this, you will be the first person to get the notification. Okay, add more experience. Let's take for instance your recent job now is a uh, sales. You are working as a sales, let's say sales assistant. Let me just put it sales assistant. 
the employer go to your employer this is one chance for market country you the date you start can say you started or um, Started 2021, for instance. Uh, which month? I say January. You can say January. You can say you currently work here. This is your most recent job. Okay. Then you click continue. They will also bring out what you need to add. It's your choice. You read through. Communicate effectively to the time your customer blah 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 blah. You click, you click, just read through the one you know you want to add, just add. Okay, this is it, guys. What next? Click continue, guys. Try and subscribe to this channel. Okay, like this video. If you have any question, leave it on the comment section. If you have any suggestion leave it in the comment section okay what next this is your experience click continue then we head over to the educational part of it okay click then what next your school name Let's say you don't have anything like uh, university, you didn't attend university back home, you just only have SSC, uh, SSC or uh, your school SAT. What will you do? You just include your, your school, your secondary school name. Let's see. That's the name uh, where you attended your school. Okay. If you're just a normal high school diploma, no? it's just a high school diploma. Okay. Sorry, you're saying. Is no more this one. So, certificate of higher education, yes, that's it. Then the field of study. Let's see. At graduation year, let's see. 2000. Add your education, list all qualifications or degree you have in, in the end or in process. This place you are going to add your what? Your certified nursing assistant uh, certificate. Okay? You are going to add it here. Okay? You add it here. You, let's say you have a certified nurse assistant CV or healthcare assistant CV. You put it here.
people did hear that you took uh, your nursing assistant CV. Come over here. Certified. Again. Guys, if you know you are not subscribed to this channel, please do go to do so. That motivates me to do more video like this. Okay, like this video. If you have any question, leave it in the comment section. Okay. If you have any questions, just leave it in the comment section. If you know you you, you are from Strong Point Educational Center, Dubai. This is how you do your CV because the exam we took is uh, is from US. That is AMCA. So we are going to put it here. Put your AMCA. Okay. See any one. Then what next? You include. Your strong points, okay. Now, Let's say for instance you don't have the VLS or you have you also put it here. Okay.
Okay, let's take for instance, you just go like this. Include all your certificates here, okay? Just include all the certificate and dates. You include them. After that, you click continue. What next? This is your education, okay? What next? You go. If you have more education, guys, you click. Okay. You know education is different from certificates. You understand? Education is uh, from your school. Certificate is just like all the certified nursing assistant certificate, caregiver certificate and all of that. Okay. You click next, continue. Your skills. Add your skills. Okay. What skills are you going to be adding? Excellent communication system. You know, in the healthcare system, the love communication. That's the first thing. What next? Ability to what? To multitask. Visibility. What next? guys but if you want to search the skills of your the type of work you are placed for instance we are applying for a nursing assistant you are applying for the nursing assistant a right nurse nurse assistant you see it here they will bring out the skills for you in case if you don't want to add, you don't want to start thinking of what to do. Let me just remove this. Okay. Any type of job you want to apply for, you can just go here and take uh, what is it called the skis. Okay. You click continue. What next? Summary. Come over to add summary. Okay. Summary is what tells them about you. Okay. These are all the summary nurse assistants. Nurse assistants. Let's say you are going for a nurse assistant. You see it here, guys. Anyone that you know you like, you want to use. See it? These are them guys. Vision. You click and you edit later. You say you want to use this one. Okay. Compassionate nurse assistant providing. Super patient care. 
for how many years did we put there as a caregiver? You see how many years? Three years. So You don't really need to have experience to do or to do this. You see, excellent attention to detail. This is in our skills that we put there. So as you are doing, you need to also follow what you are doing. And plenty, blah, 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 blah. You add every edit, everything on your own. Okay. What next? You click continue. Let's see. If you have accomplishment, you add. If you don't have accomplishment, professional affiliation, additional information, certification, your language, if you want to add, you add. But what we don't have there now is what? Um, let's say computer skills is not there. You put computer skills. This is your computer skills that you, you have. Okay, MS Word. This one is excellent, but excellent internet efficiency. That's it guys. Just click continue. Let's say you want to also add again. Guys, these are the list of all the what is it called? The template. As you can see the templates are here. You can decide on which one you want now. They are here. The template that you like. Okay? Which one is beautiful now? Let's go with this one. Let's go with this one. Then template. Okay, format. This is it guys. If 
you want to check your spare check you click here you check okay if you want to add more session that is let's say for instance you want to add your what your reference you add okay let's see reference you need to have at least two reference but if you don't have you put available upon request if you don't have a, you put available upon request in case you do not ask you to provide your reference then you look for response someone to help you out okay this is it guys this is the CV template as you can see this is it this is HK assistant CV or certified nursing assistant CV without what without experience this is how you create it okay this is how you create it guys as you can see this is how you create it This is your if you, if you want to also edit you can also edit it here you can edit if you want to increase the size you can increase this this is your photo if you want to change the photo you can also change anything you want to do you can also do it from here okay this is your skills this 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 computer skills this is your education and what next again this reference available upon request if that you have a, a reference you include your reference names here if you don't have you say available or what upon request okay in case they now ask you to provide reference then you bring your reference out so what next guys this is it what next you say save and next now they will ask you to log in because you want to download it this is it. they will ask you to log in let's say for instance you want to download they will ask you to log in if you want to print the same thing they want you to pay for it once you log in you are going to pay for it so we are not going to pay for it what are we going to do huh all this you copy all this uh what is it called everything here you copy it and take it to your whatsapp copy everything here and take it to your whatsapp after you are taking it to your whatsapp everything here this you copy this you copy this you copy this you copy and try to create this type of design okay you try and create this type of design or any type of design you want you check for the design here or any type of design you try and create the exact type of design okay using your ms word if you know you don't know how to create a design you don't know how to create a design like this what you have to do is if you have any template at all huh, you copy everything here go and paste it on your template okay copy everything from this place you paste it there copy everything from here because all these things they are not from your head you, they, you, you stole it from this place everything here they are not from your head everything here everything here everything here same same okay that is it guys please try and like this video subscribe to this channel that motivate me to do more video like this okay this is how you do it